Hello and welcome back to Panzerkorps. Uh, this time it's Manstein's turn to open up uh, Operation Barbarossa. Uh, as always, I've already completed the setup. Uh, let's see what we have done. I've bought elite reinforcements for all of our units and I got to an Earth Dranks level of 12. Um, where possible, uh, of course, some are not able to reach that yet. As you see, all are kept at 12. Exception, of course, the artillery. Um, I've bought two Wurfrahmen. And yeah, the fighters are kept at 12 too. And the bombers are overstrengthened as much as possible because I hope they won't get any damage. Uh, the reason is um, increasing levels of overstrengths are getting extremely uh, expensive. So 12, I think, is a good compromise. Uh, a 12 strength unit should be able to deal with the 15 strength units of the Russians. And um, yeah not cost too much. Uh, we have 3,100 prestige left, so we are good on that front. And as far as deployment goes, uh, we have two groups. Um, let's call them army group. Uh, it's no army. Uh, group north and south. Um, they will, in the first turns, both um, try to collapse this pocket and then move on uh, to the east. Right. It shouldn't be a problem because we have plenty of time and we are not going for a decisive victory. So as much for the setup, uh, see you at the actual mission. So here we are, uh, let's kick off the mission. Um, you see our two army groups, uh, not army groups, uh, well, I don't know how to call them. Let's let's call them army troops. Doesn't matter. So, uh, well, let's start the mission. Uh, first, I want to take this city because it opens a path um, around. We don't have to cross the river there. Uh, the Wolf Ramen are really excellent for suppressing units. First city is ours. Um, very important is to deny uh, the enemy vision, of course. Yeah, the Air Force will be our biggest problem. The 15 strengths, enemy fighters and bombers are a real pain. So I want them to see as little as possible. Uh, so we can defend our valuable units with, well, our rather small Air Force. We've only got four fighters. So it will be difficult to block everything. Well, that was a pretty successful start. We have concentrated a lot of artillery there. Scouting. Very important. And now it's time to get rid of this cavalry unit because it has a really big vision range. That's it. We could have used a bomber to do it uh, if we weren't able to destroy it. So that's not that difficult to do it. And now the Russians are completely in the dark down there. We don't have to worry. Moreover, we can set up a trap now. So those are in vision range and we can put a fighter there, yeah. And we are building a defensive perimeter around here. Um, this artillery I will draw out of, of the danger zone. Um, I hope it won't get spotted there. Uh, next turn it can start bombarding uh, across the river. So our main concern is this force here. We have to build a defensive screen here. As 
suppressed the tank and now we can concentrate our air force around here trapped first enemy fighter that was pretty successful eight damage none taken another successful trap only four damage but it was too suppressed to do any harm don't care if they attack the infantry and they are preparing and moving all the forces to the front I've never seen that so that's very interesting for me too where the enemy units are located attacking the artillery, the stork, not very smart I've upgraded um, one moment I've upgraded uh, my 88 to a more mobile version uh, that's not a good idea as you've seen this is really crappy and there's almost no damage um, I thought I'd try it but well don't do it now we are forcing our way across the river once again concentrate the artillery on Manstein that's very important Force them onto the river and now we hopefully can wipe them out. Yeah, that's it. Guarding the river crossing. Now we can take the city. They are completely suppressed, so no danger there. And the pocket is collapsed on turn two. Not a bad outcome. So let's get rid of this T26. Suppress and destroy. That's our kind of game. Suppress again. And now it's gone. Now we have to break through the woods there. Ah, they got lucky. <laughs> Using artillery to do it. Okay, another infantry gone. The guarding artillery has been forced back. Now it's time to deal with the Russian Air Force. They're not really dangerous, but there are many. Uh, one plus movement for a fighter, that's bad, it that doesn't help much. So our fighters are doing huge damage, 10 damage done to this bomber, so they are all damaged and have to retreat. The second wave. Doesn't do much. Yeah, that's why it's important to guard the river, uh, the river crossings, the bridges. <laughs> oh, that's a lot of tanks. Ooh, and our artillery, uh, our cavalry almost got destroyed. Uh, and they're deciding to to guard, uh, to reinforce at Brest. So this will be quite a pain to take this a little bit of maneuvering to clear the way for our troops 
yeah the artillery is gone and now we can concentrate on the attack on Volkovsik trying to force the randoms but they are yeah that should work yeah uh, that doesn't bring too much prestige but everything counts and yeah they decided to build another strong point here there um, we can surround them so that shouldn't be a problem next turn another unit gone very important on Manstein is to really finish off troops because if they come back to 15 strengths that's bad obviously yeah we have to destroy all those pesky little tanks Caught an artillery there. Nice job. Yeah, I should have suppressed them first, but no, never mind. No, 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 no. Don't do it because we had no vision on them, so we could have run into an air defense. So it was fine this way. Now we are starting to destroy fighters. Very important on Manstein in order not to get overwhelmed. Just damaging doesn't do the job. Because they will come back at full strength. Ah, more tanks. Stooks are doing a good job at oh, taking the blow. <laughs> wow, seven damage by a level bomber. Never seen that. But 14 strength points are a lot. So that helps. Another fighter gone. Building a defensive formation. So our bombers can do their job. I should have used. Ah, uh, two unnecessary damage points. But I wanted to save the artillery uh, for the attack on the city. We are not in a hurry, so this was actually a bad decision. At least they are running out of ammunition. Ah, more reinforcements there, that's more surrenders. Yeah. Well, 30 prestige, won't complain about that. In the marshes, um, the effectiveness of the enemy uh, tanks is very reduced. Another surrender there. 20 prestige. And the next surrender is lined up. Yeah, that was enough. I 
I want to get rid of this uh, gun because there's no defensive artillery. This is out of ammunition and this can transform uh, into an anti-tank cannon. So I want to get rid of them. 50th ranks anti-tank cannon uh, could could wipe out my tank, so I have to deal with them. Ah, they caught my wolf ramen. That's annoying. At least it wasn't at over strength, so it's not that bad. Well, the next city is ours. Now we have free open terrain ahead of us. Well, on. this is mop up duty. It's just a matter of time now. I think we can force another surrender, yeah. Yeah, great. Quickest way to do it in Manstein, force them to surrender. Um, yeah. The strongest opposition is out of the way. Planes are doing great, they are taking almost no damage. Well, and let's wait what they can do. Ah, here comes a T-34. This one is the dangerous unit. It has to be destroyed. Yeah, it's gone. Here feel taken. Ah, we spotted the enemy bomber, that's really great. Now there's not much in our way. The wolf ramen and the artillery. 
will absolutely demolish them. Caught another artillery. And once they're suppressed, they're absolutely no danger. ran into a trap but uh, they couldn't do anything and well we spotted the tank ah another guarding fighter we got surprised again but now it's damaged but yeah another one damaged and now we are starting to lose fighters. Don't think you can avoid that, but it costs prestige, so yeah, I'm not happy about that. And once again, they hit my Wolfram, and that's really annoying. Ooh. again now it's starting to get a little bit tense this one had a bad day <laughs> they cannot see the artillery so this was a perfect surprise and now it's time to wipe out the enemy air force it's really annoying yeah we are closing in on Brest not bothering to enforce this artillery anymore and we have to get rid of this T-34 it's the most dangerous enemy unit left And our artillery is completely running out of ammunition. So, um, we are losing a little bit of momentum now. Uh, still, those pesky tutorial messages. And we're destroying a lot of enemy units trying to surround um, T-34 4 damage, 6 taken 3-3 three, three. and no damage but it's starting to run out of ammunition <laughs> So, <laughs> don't lose the hope, uh, we can do it. Another fighter gone. We have got the airfield, that's very important. To resupply. Resupplied our artillery. Meanwhile, Yep, the defensive artillery did it, it's out of ammunition, ah, they caught our Stuck, our Stuka. Ah, it's a little bit tense now.
But once we have cleared the anti-tank capability, we can close in on Brest. Now spotting for our Panzer. Not bad, but not great. Now artillery is in supply again. Uh, this one has defensive anti-aircraft uh, anti fire, so couldn't use my bomber there. So I used the level bomber. And once again a resistance, a strong point. They are having a lot of prestige. And we are running a little bit low on the flanks of our units. But we are all only 8 turns in. So we can take our time and play it rather safe. Surrender, uh, surrounded, digging them out. Uh, not much left that can surrender. But yeah, Knights Cross and plus initiative, that's good. And there's a 20th Dranks conscript unit. Uh, that's no joke, actually. <laughs> There's 20 shots, so we're bringing up our Sturks to defend. Uh, it survived. Didn't, didn't care. It's only non core unit. Once again, surround and destroy. And more surrenders. We are building up our prestige. Once again, we caught the Bomber Squadron. And now it's gone. <laughs> Don't want to risk getting it's getting reinforced again. Another surrender. This was quicker than expected. The Russian infantry is, is not that great. So experience and overstrength unit can deal with it rather easily. Yeah, we are I would say two third uh, through the map. If we are nine turns in, so we're not in a hurry. This is a nasty surprise. Okay. Attacking my Fasio Megas. And Brest is really tough. Okay, got really lucky there. I have to bring my whole air force to try and save it. 
Not sure if I'm able to. Other reinforcements. Now it's time to clear uh, the last anti aircraft cannon. No. It doesn't work out, but. At least the Falschimiga survived. That was the main goal. Yeah, they are out of ammunition, so I'm risking going in. Scouting ahead, there's not much in our way. Only conscripts. I think the resistance is more or less broken. We are playing it safe now, but I don't expect any more trouble. Um, they have used, I think, the last forces in, in the counter attack. Well, now our artillery is just too overwhelming. This river is the last thing that's in our way. I think the enemy air force is gone. Blocking the city to don't want any more surprises up there. And I simply want to block all the cities. No more conscripts. And the level bombers are really effective this time. Yeah, the conscripts don't stand any chance against our Panzer Force. Katyusha gone. We're almost gone. Now that's it. And we can concentrate on the final targets. It's only turn 12. I think we could do a decisive victory here, especially if we ignored some of the minor targets. But it's about getting prestige up and getting experience up. Okay. 
so I don't bother to reinforce now. It's enough to guard with artillery. I'm still wary to go near with my tank. Now it's on the river, so... slowly whittling them, whittling them down. <laughs> I don't care about those. And the artillery is doing its job. Uh, movement plus one, that's, that's good for artillery. Especially for the towed one. They are reinforcing there, but it only means more chaos for our units. Seven damage. Keeping them on the river. So they are easy target for the bombers. Yeah, bringing in the wolf ramen, taking them out. A lot of conscripts. I'm not shooting with this wolf ramen. I want the defensive fire because it's almost out of ammunition. Spotting, there's nothing left. And we're already blocking the last city. It's turn 13. Yeah. The conscripts, I think, have only a vision range of one. Yeah, <laughs> wasn't quite enough, but yeah. Now Brest is gone. It was only a non-core unit. Once again, resupplying the artillery. We want to be in good shape for the last attack. And yeah, we have to spend our final 10 turns. We were almost too quick once again, uh, like on Rommel. So let's see. I might want to leave the city open. No, obviously I want to get rid of the anti-aircraft cannon. That's a good choice, by the way. And now they can do nothing. Um, all is protected by artillery. And we are clearing up the final resistance. about getting a little bit of experience. Oh, 
Well, that's it. Only one unit left. And now I want them to buy more units in order to get more experience. Uh, yeah. We baited out two anti tank cannons. A Knight's Cross. <laughs> it was very brief. I want all my artillery units to fire. Well, we got another infantry, a uh, conscript. I'm not sure if they are gaining experience, uh, because especially artillery's are the, the towed ones are very experienced, so... Don't worry, we are almost finished. One turn to go. Not much much tension now, but yeah. More experience always is handy and well uh, no, uh, not not great. Defense plus two for artillery. Hope we won't use it, need it. script it's the final turn That's it, a marginal victory, but yeah, um, not much, uh, not more is needed on Barbarossa um, because we don't want to go to Moscow that soon and we will go to Kiev anyways, so marginal victory is enough. So let's view the battlefield. Um, there was a lot, lot of room to cover, but you can easily do a, a decisive victory here, uh, especially if you bypass one of the minor targets. So no problems there, uh, pretty successful, we have gained a lot of prestige and see you at the Kiev pocket, bye!